In this video, we're going to look at selection and we're going to look at how we can create an if statement um, in Microsoft Small Basic. So the first thing we're going to do is just collect some information. Uh, let's say we're collecting a name. So first thing I'm going to do is uh, use the text window dot right line command to display a message. Um, text window dot right line. Uh, let's say enter your name. Oh, let's go with hello. Hello. Enter your name. That information is then going to be typed in and stored in a name variable or a variable that I've called name. So we set the variable name text window dot read. So again, what's that now? What that is now saying? is whatever the user types in into the keyboard will now be stored in the variable name. So to start off my selection statement block or my if statement block, I'm gonna need the keyword if. Uh, we're looking for my name in this case. So let's say if name equals uh, Mr. Ahmed. And then we end it with then. So if name, if the user types in the name Mr. Ahmed, it's going to display the message text window dot right line. Hi, Mr. Ahmed. You are amazing. Okay, and then if you type in a name which is not Mr. Ahmed, we got else, let's put a capital E there for good practice. Else, so if you type in a name which is not Mr. Ahmed, then it's gonna output text window right line. Let's go with you are not Mr. Ahmed. Okay. And then to end our selection statement, our if statement block, we have the keyword end if. So that red exclamation mark will keep displaying until you basically finish the whole if statement block. So let's run it now and see what that does. So hello, enter your name, and let's type in a random name. Nope. There we go. So I've typed in a random name and it's now displayed the message, you are not Mr. Ahmed. So if you go back and run it again, this time let's type in Mr. Ahmed. There we go, it's now displayed the message, hi Mr. Ahmed, you are amazing. So if you go back here, we've collected some information, we stored it in a name variable, um, we're then making a decision on that variable. If that variable contains the information or the data or the name, Mr. Ahmed, then it's going to output, hi, Mr. Ahmed, you are amazing. Else, it's going to output, you are not Mr. Ahmed, and then it's going to end the program.